So one of my plays that I've been working on is a musical called In the Middle of the Night. And I just want to share that I, I do believe in things that happen in the middle of the night because I've witnessed them. You know, my play In the Middle of the Night, it's actually a musical and it's something that is really part of who I am. It's, it's, it's the essence of me because, you know, as a spiritual being and someone who's grown up Catholic, um, you know, I've read the Bible, quite a bit of it, and the story of Samuel, if you do know it, great, I'm going to share it with you. But in the book of Samuel, you know, Samuel goes to sleep and in the middle of the night he hears his name being called and he goes to see his father and says, you know, Dad, what did you want? And his father said, I didn't call you. And it happens two more times in the night and the third time his father actually says to him, that's God calling you, ask God what he wants. And there are, there have been, and still are so many times I awake in the middle of the night with this urging to write. And I get up and I will pen a story or a prayer or a song or a monologue or thoughts. And later on I get to use either the exact wording I've done or the essence of those wordings to create a story. And my play in the middle of the night is, you know, it's the story of a writer struggling with their muse because it's real. You know, if I'm sleeping at night and I'm really tired and that muse is saying, get up, you got to write this. You know, sometimes I say, ah, uh, can you come back tomorrow? But, you know, there's stories in the air and I know a lot of musicians can definitely resonate with this, that if you don't sit and write it right then, it just kind of flies away and then it's gone. Sometimes you can't get that moment back. So in the middle of the night, I do a lot of my inspired writing for sure and you know the play or my musical in the middle of the night I'm very excited to you know be having this produced soon it's it's got about 18 songs in it and I think that a lot of people are going to resonate with the story of just kind of fighting with their dreams um, you know trying to negotiate a story and putting it out there so the real story of a writer.